It's been a little bit since we've had one of these. This is the beautiful M4. 2023, 23 registration, like new in Portima Blue. This car's only got 600 miles on, guys, and it's not gonna hang around for too long because of the specification. Yes, the M4s do come very well specced, but when you get one like this with visibility package, comfort package, tech pack plus package, it really has everything, and it's done 600 miles, so it's perfect. Beautiful colour, lots of power, 510 brake horsepower to be precise. Not the 60 in 3.9 seconds, that's pretty impressive. It's a new model car, so it's new generation, very up to date, super aggressive, and it has a brilliant look about it. It's come down in price, that's another very important thing that you should know, and now it's good value for money. For me, let's start with the front. The visibility package means you've got laser headlights. Now, I've seen a lot of M cars out there, and I think laser headlights is a big feature. It looks good, but it actually does something as well. You've then got the Fusion Blue daytime running lights, the gloss black kidney grills, and as we all know, the new kidney grills in the BMWs, it's been a couple of years now, we've got used to it, and it has a brilliant, menacing look. You've got the black corner skirts, vents, and then this one has the 360 camera system, front rear parking sensors, adaptive cruise control, it's full of it. You've then got the bonnet humps going on here. It's very sharp, very angular, very good looking. You've then got the competition wheels, front and rear, with a diamond black chrome finish on the outside and the black on the inside with the red brake calipers. Cross-drilled discs as well, just to make it a little bit easier to brake, really. You've then got the competition air vents, M mirrors with the LED indicators, high shadow line window surrounds, and the full carbon roof with a double groove but it just gets better. You've got the full black leather interior with the Alcantara sections, the illuminated M4 in the headrest, but then this carbon fiber interior inlays. That's a center tunnel, center dash. But then this one has Harman Kardon sound system, ambient lighting system, electric seats with lumbar support as well. But as I get in, you just, it's comfortable, it's sporty, you have the bucket style seating here. It's like new, remember, 600 miles. Key feature, when an MCAT does a thousand miles, it has to have its running in service done. Now this one hasn't hit a thousand miles yet, but it has got an already paid for service plan. So if you collect it, you do your next 400 miles, you book it in at your most local BMW dealership, under the service plan, the service, the running in service is paid for, which is nice, and the next service after that as well. The M4 entry kick plate, Beautiful. Normally these do scratch quite easily, but this one without having 600 miles on is absolutely immaculate. You've then got the two keys, wireless charging pad, twin cup holders, USB, iDrive system, different modes set up there, heated seats, dual zone climate control. There's your 360 camera system. This is touch screen and you have got the reversing assistant on this as well. Center armrest lifts up with USC in there and more crib hole space. Lovely new design to the lighting system. It is a four seater coupe and the back seats again have a beautiful look to them with the ICVX attachments. You've also got M seat belts. As you come to the back of the car, the first thing you'll notice is the hard rear shoulders, nice and aggressive and it sits very well. Stretched LED rear lighting system and the LED indicators. Full black rear diffuser followed by the four black exhaust tips which make a cracking sound. You've got a nice booted spoiler, only nice and small, but it flicks up like a ducktail, just enough. Reversing camera is in the BMW roundel itself. Automatic tailgate, which is part of the comfort pack, it's not standard. And then you've got a very nice generous boot where the seats go down just by pulling these levers there. The car's perfect. The running in service, another extra cost you don't need to think about. When you're buying nice, expensive, high performance cars, you sometimes think, well, it's going to cost me a fortune to service it. Well, forget on this one, you don't need to because it's paid for. Running in service, like I said is paid for. Comfort access, so if the key's in your pocket, not standard, part of the comfort pack. So that's nice as well. Electric windows, mirrors, there's a Harman Kardon sound system again. And then you've got a heads up display, which is just about here. You've got the full carbon steering wheel with the M1 and M2 shortcut bones, so you can configure them and set it up or preset them. Carbon elongated paddle shift, heated steering wheel, nice M colors stitched into the M steering wheel as well. It's perfect. Sound. Sounds good, looks good, drives incredible. Recap, visibility package, comfort package, tech pack plus package, 600 miles, service plan paid for, 23 registration, which means you've got warranty until 2026. It's like buying a brand new M4 without paying brand new price.
It's physical, it's available. What do you think of this colour? I love it. It's been such a long time since I've seen one, so I almost think it's individual, but I know it's not. But it's a fabulous portable blue, it's a great M colour. My name is Joe, give me a call, drop me a text or a WhatsApp. If you've got a current M car now, the F model, I'll take it in part exchange. You might have a Mercedes AMG and you fancy going into the M product, give me a call, I'll take it in part exchange. Available on PCP and HP, give me a call, drop me a text or a WhatsApp. Thanks for watching, bye bye now.